Right now, Tennessee Republicans are advancing a proposal to ban transgender athletes from participating in public school sports. Specifically, they're looking to ban transgender girls and women from public school and college sports teams. In fact, Tennessee is just one out of about a dozen different states looking to pass very similar legislation. The argument being made is that of science. Tennessee Governor Bill Lee says allowing transgender athletes to compete in female sports will completely destroy women's sports because of the biological differences between biological males and biological females. Testosterone levels really being the main factor. Transgender athletes who are biologically male will naturally be stronger, faster, bigger than biological females. Opponents, on the other hand, say bills like these will cause transgender athletes to be likely singled out and harassed. To even further strengthen their argument, they're pointing out an executive order signed by President Joe Biden. It bans discrimination based on gender identity in school sports. Interesting, isn't it, how science applies when it comes to things like the environment and COVID, but not when it comes to athletes? It's equally as interesting that the same people who champion women's rights are the same ones tossing aside the existence of biological females. Should transgender athletes be allowed to participate in high school and college sports? Even if that means biological women lose most of the time. You tell me.